Good morning. Our final devotion for this Holy Week is Matthew 28, verses 1 to 20. Hallelujah. Our risen Lord has... After the Sabbath, as the first day of the week was dawning, Mary Magdalene and other Mary went to the tomb, and suddenly there was a great earthquake, for an angel of the Lord descending from heaven came and rolled back the stone and sat on it. His appearance was like lightning, and his clothing white as snow. For fear of him, the guards shook and became like dead men. But the angel saw the woman. Do not be afraid. I know that you are looking for Jesus, who was crucified. He's not here. For he has been raised, as he said. Come see the place where he lay. Then go quickly and tell his disciples, He has been raised from the dead, and indeed he is going ahead of you to Galilee. There you will see him. This is my message for you. So they left the tomb quickly, with fear and great joy, and ran to tell his disciples. So then Jesus met them and said, Greetings! And they came to him and took hold of his feet and worshipped him. And Jesus said to them, Do not be afraid. Go and tell my brothers to go to Galilee. There they will see me. The report of the guard. While they were going, some of the guard went into the city and told the chief priest everything that had happened. After the priests had assembled with the elders to devise a plan to give a large sum of money to the soldiers, telling them, You must say, His disciples came by night and stole him away while we were asleep. If this comes to the governor's ears, we will satisfy him and keep you out of trouble. So they took the money and did as they were directed. And the story is still told among the Jews to this day. The Commission of the Disciples Now the eleven disciples went to Galilee, to the mountain to which Jesus had directed them. When they saw him, they worshipped him, but they some doubted. And Jesus came and said to them, All authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. Go therefore and make disciples of all nations. Baptize them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. And teach them to obey everything that I have commanded you. Remember, I am with you always to the end of the age. Amen. Three quick points for today. When the female followers came to the tomb, Jesus was no longer there in the grave. He had risen. And point two. What have you learned about God this week, during the Holy Week? Sit down and think about this. What have you learned about God this week? Was there anything new you learned? And has your faith changed? And point three, very simple. You know, God has called us, every one of us, to do something in our lives. Sometimes people think it's something simple, but everything God has called for you to do is important and during this time God has called people to do certain things and God has called people to do certain other things so in this holy week may God bless you take care bye bye